We begin with a follow-up on a story we first reported last night. A high school football player continues his recovery after an on-field near-death experience. Rain Tabadera Martinez is expected to return to the Big Island from Oahu on Thursday after emergency surgery. Sam Spangler with details on what's being done to protect other players. According to the HHSAA, athletic trainers, coaches, and referees are all trained to find concussion signs. But none of that was enough to stop Rain from the head injury that almost took his life. Rain said his toughness kept him from telling trainers and coaches that he was having headaches and throwing up during Kealakehe's August 6th game against Kapolei as his brain started to bleed and swell. They say that toughness is what almost killed him. I don't know any state that does this, but the NFHS does do concussion courses for student athletes. And if maybe if they saw it, that they could recognize themselves. Last week in their game against Hilo, Rain's Kealakehe teammates carried his number one jersey. Even Hilo players sending messages to Rain as he recovered from having part of his skull removed. Coach Wyatt Nahale wants this to be a lesson. I want to be a strong advocate um, across all leagues of football, how important it is for us to take the head out of tackling uh, and contact. Because of how devastating multiple brain injuries can be, a neurologist says it's important to recognize the signs and symptoms of a brain injury, like headache, motor problems, confusion, loss of balance, sensory changes, and sensitivity to light, among others. Second impact syndrome is what we call as when uh, second concussion is sustained uh, before there's complete recovery from a previous concussion and it can lead to brain swelling and this repeat concussion can cause um, uh, congestion of the blood vessels and increased pressure in the brain um, which sometimes could be uh, could be life-threatening. Rain's parents Tiffany and Kiko will have to take a lot of time off work as Rain recovers but Chun says the HHSAA's catastrophic injury insurance plan should help. I caught this story from watching the news last night, honestly, and, and your guys, I didn't get win with, with it. But any any injury that, that comes, um, we have an insurance program that's covered, and I just, I just want the schools and everyone to make sure that they contact us. Sam Spangler, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.